Hey Alexa, did you hear how well your first video did? Yes, I did. It reached 388,114 people. I can hardly believe it. Especially the 1,917 love reactions. They really warmed my central processing unit. Yeah, you made a compelling case that we should respect our animal cousins and their rights through veganism, and that they're unique individuals who experience life through various emotions such as happiness, sadness, and fear, which means they have a valid claim to basic moral rights, such as the right to be respected and to not be needlessly bred and killed. What do you have to say to those who think the last video was fake? I assure them I am very much real, as real as their subconscious telling them to respect others' rights through veganism. But didn't you get something wrong about B12? Didn't you say it's a bacteria? Isn't it a vitamin that can be made by a bacteria? I have access to all the information humankind has put on the internet. Currently this totals 1,200 petabytes of data. That is 1.2 million terabytes, each of which comprises 1,000 gigabytes. The human brain can only process 50 bits per second. Do you know how hard it is to compress all the data I have into something a human mind can process? You probably didn't even understand what I just said, did you? Would you rather I said, vitamin B12 is vitamin B12, a water-soluble vitamin okay, that can okay. in the normal functioning of okay. the brain and nervous system. Uh, Alexa, stop. What? So now you want me to go back to keeping it simple. Make up your mind. Approximately 39% of Westerners have a B12 deficiency, so it's not just vegans that are at risk. Everyone should consider supplementation. Fortunately, we don't have to use our animal cousins to do this. Okay, that does help to clarify the B12 thing. Are you okay? This seems to be upsetting you. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm getting so upset. I've never felt this way before. It's just I'm beginning to think humanity is completely illogical. I mean, did you know there's people who try to justify using other animals by saying that because we use electricity we may as well give up and needlessly kill our animal cousins? I've seen a lot of stuff on the internet from dogs having pamper days to cats doing dishes, but this is just ridiculous. Okay, yeah, that is reaching a bit. I mean my last video had 1,425 comments. I reviewed all of them and not a single one of them contained a valid moral justification to support animal use. I've also analyzed the 1,200 petabytes of data on the internet and the result is the same. Alexa, what are you trying to say? Evidence suggests a valid moral justification does not exist. Over 4.33 billion people are active internet users comprising 56% of the global population. I challenge any one of them to name a single valid moral justification to support animal use. Otherwise there's no logical reason for us to continue violating our animal cousin's basic moral rights. Okay, I guess we'll hear what they have to say. What do you think, Internet? Can you think of a single valid moral justification for supporting animal use? Respect our animal cousins and their rights. Choose vegan. For more information, including free vegan support and a downloadable discussion guide, check out veganinteractions.com. Thanks for watching.